Hi, I'm Joe Hage. I am the leader of the Medical Devices Group on LinkedIn, which, as of this recording, has 285,000 members worldwide, and I am privileged to be the host of this next session at WBBA-TV. Welcome all you in TV land. I am here with Lynn Rose. She is the Director of Scientific Administration at the Benaroya Research Institute at Virginia Mason. What would you say is the overarching direction for BRI? And how do you interact with Virginia Mason, which is headquartered here in Seattle? Sure. Uh, Benaroya Research Institute is an independent organization, but uh, falls under the umbrella of the Virginia Mason Health System. Uh, in that relationship, we work very closely with the hospital at Virginia Mason. Uh, we actually provide all of the support for their clinical research program. So all of the physicians at Virginia Mason who conduct clinical research studies in partnership with pharmaceutical companies are supported by Benner Research Institute staff. Uh, we provide the coordinators and the infrastructure to do clinical research studies at Virginia Mason. Virginia Mason is also a very important partner in our biorepositories. We have biorepositories, meaning tissue, uh, and blood uh, sample repositories for every autoimmune disease that we study. And, this and how is many is that? About 12. Okay. Uh, we study the immune system at BRI. The principle is that the immune um, dysfunction in a lot of autoimmune diseases is very similar and if you understand what's happening in one of them you probably understand what's happening in more than one of them I see. and so these repositories are incredibly important in understanding the similarities and the differences between those autoimmune diseases tell me how many employees are at the Institute there's approximately 275 oh employees wow. at the Institute and a large number of volunteers we have at least 50 volunteers, student interns, graduate students that are coming in to uh, do various research projects. Okay. So the, the number swells. On their way to their PhD, I suppose. Yes, on their way to their PhD. Now, you mentioned that um, you are focused exclusively in the autoimmune world. Is that right? Yes. Are there other uh, bodies out there not associated with you, not associated with Virginia Mason, that are doing similar work? And if so, how, if at all, do you collaborate and share your information with them? There are a lot of institutions, uh, and particularly pharmaceutical companies, that are working in those diseases under the same principle that if you understand the immune dysfunction in one, it may be applicable to another. I don't think there's another institute in the United States that is focused solely on autoimmune diseases and the, uh, the immune system dysfunctions that are occurring. We're pretty unique in that respect. Who? should call you? What would be uh, the type of person, what role, what are they doing that would be, oh my god, I'm really glad I watched that interview with Lynn, <laughs> give me her number, I need to call her and talk to her about what project? I think any uh, organization that's developing therapeutics that interfere with some part of the immune system should call us. We have scientists that are extremely uh, informed about different functions of cells within the immune system, and if you really want to know what your therapeutic is doing to the immune system, you should call Benaroya Research Institute. So to wrap up, I'm a scientist, yes. I'm working on this, these disease states. How aware is that community about BRI at Virginia Mason? I think the world is very aware of Benaroya Research Institute. As I mentioned earlier, uh, we are providing the leadership for, for the trial net for type 1 diabetes. We are also providing the leadership in uh, Dr. Jerry Nepom for the Immune Tolerance Network, which is an international effort to study um, all uh, immune-based diseases. So we have a lot of uh, power and uh, force, I guess, in the, in the community when it comes to autoimmune disease and allergy. Excellent. Well, thank you very much. Oh, you're welcome. This is Joe Hage. I've been talking with Lynn Rose, the Director of Scientific Administration for Benaroya Research Institute at Virginia Mason. And if you are a scientist and you are working on uh, autoimmune diseases, Call Lynn it. Rose is the person to reach. <laughs> thank you very much for WBBA-TV.